Thanks for having me. That's great to have Good you to here. See Good you to again. see you too. It's yeah. been too long. When you were 17 years old, were you nominated for any Grammys? Uh, I would actually, it was me and uh, my mom was a single mom, so I'd, she wasn't around. She had three jobs, so I would actually be alone all the time, and I would just take my piece of crap 4x4 four four and go uh, into the bush, have bonfires, maybe have a beer or 10. By yourself? And uh, no, I would oh, literally pile it up with I as see. many people as possible. Gotcha. And uh, go do that, sleep in, and probably do it again the next night. So arson and alcoholism yes, exactly. were your favorite. <laughs> I was honestly surprised that I graduated. Were you really? I am. OK, so you're living in Austin, Texas. Yeah. A lot of celebrities live in Austin, Texas, yeah. right? Yeah, like more for, and more. Yeah. Who yeah. else lives near you? Who's your, who are your neighbors? Um, well, I got a call a couple years ago. And I was, at the time, in my little apartment. And uh, get a call, pick it up, obviously, and it's, hey, this is, uh, this is Tommy Lee Jones. And I go, no, it's not. <laughs> uh, we've never met nothing. Uh -huh. And uh, he's like, well, you know, yeah, it is. How you doing? And I go, no. <laughs> and he's finally, he's like, well, what, what are you doing this Thursday? And I'm like, you tell me what I'm doing this Thursday. <laughs> and uh, so he asked me to go to his ranch. And uh, obviously, I said, he's an icon, a living icon. Yeah, so well, this like, is a strange way to, yeah, nobody told you he was going to be cool. No he just idea. Called. Okay. And uh, it's I gonna think. It's going to be a trap, the way I'm A catfish hearing. or something. Yeah, you know? right, for sure. Uh, so I go, obviously, and uh, he's got a beautiful ranch, and he comes out, and, uh, you know, we're driving all of a sudden, and it's like, you know, let's, you want to grab a cold one or whatnot? So we go through this. Uh, drive through liquor uh -huh. liquor store drive through <laughs> tiny town and they know him and i'm just like in his pickup truck going through a drive through and we go on his ranch and we just walked around and chatted about the work and i tried to assimilate as much as i possibly could and amazing guy and i think he was sussing me out for a a gig oh he was writing a western and i've always wanted to do one uh-huh and um and he hasn't called back. <laughs> <laughs> Bottom line, that's really what it boils down to. So whatever he was looking for, yeah, you didn't I give I it didn't, to him. I didn't have it. <laughs> didn't have it. Well, that's no really extra weird. work. That nothing. was it, huh? Yeah. Wow. How about that? Is it true the first movie you did was Snakes on a Plane? Absolutely. Oh, what was it like making that movie? <sighs> Brilliant. I mean, we Brilliant. were on like a plane, like a fake plane the whole time. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean. <laughs> There was, I hate snakes. By well, the yeah, way. everyone I hates hate them. them. Sure. No, like, I genuinely, really don't like yeah. Okay. And uh, they gave us a little tour of all the snakes, not poisonous and all this. And I was the first guy that dies in the, in the plane. I'm in the bathroom, <laughs> have sex with my girlfriend in the bathroom, uh -huh. maybe smoke a joint in there. Uh -huh. And I take down the uh, fire detector, and that's how all the snakes get in. <laughs> so we're locked in in the bathroom, in the show, obviously, in the movie. We're locked in. <laughs> and they've been biting me for 30 minutes. In, in, no, no, no. In the movie, they in have. In the script. Right. Right, OK. So I need 13 hours of makeup oh. to get all the bites and all this. So we're going to shoot opening the door and me coming out dead. So you obviously just f fall down onto a mat. Uh -huh. But you can't move. You're dead. Hold your breath. Do all that fun stuff. And uh, so I'm like, yeah, I'm ready. I can do this. Uh-huh. And. Uh, they open the door, I fall down, no one tells me. But off camera, there's two guys behind the seats pouring live snakes on top of me. And no I'm one told kidding. me beforehand. No one told me. What? I'm holding my breath, trying to be dead, which obviously did not happen. <laughs> I lost it. I don't blame I you. I lost it. I would so, have sued everyone on that fake plane. <laughs> So everybody's getting sued. <laughs> Everyone. Was Sam uh, Jackson there to witness he this? Was he not, was not. He was oh, not. He would never have allowed that to happen. But the uh, <laughs> director came out, apologized. <laughs> apologized. <laughs> and Sorry, uh, he's dumped... like, they're not poisonous. <laughs> Great. Wow. But that was, that was. People intense. think it's glamorous being yeah. in a, a big budget movie like Snakes Welcome on the to Plane. Snakes on a Plane. <laughs> Now, what about this movie, uh, 21 yes. Bridges? Yeah. You play a criminal. 
I do. Being, and you are being pursued by Chadwick Boseman. Yes, yes. Yeah. So they shut down. It's kind of an ode to the, the noir films that yeah. we grew up, like yeah. The Heats, the, and dare I compare it to like Mean Streets. It's a New York-based movie. They shut down Manhattan and hunt myself and Stefan James, who's amazing in it as well, and it all J.K. Takes Simmons. All in, takes place night. in one, one night. night. Right, yeah. So shooting nights, I don't I wish that on anyone. Oh, because you'd have to be up all night. But with that, you know, the bars are closed around 2 or 3 in the mm -hmm. morning, and we're outside doing a big shootout uh, in the movie. And uh, you look, we looked over, and it was like around 3. And uh, there's a few women, a couple guys, and they're arguing. And they're just, there's, you have to block the streets, obviously. And it's public area, mm -hmm. so they're right at the border of like where the blockade is. And we're like, you know, let's call you a cab, whatever. You sh I mean, she's in toxic, hammered. Oh, okay, hammered. <laughs> Great. Just came out of the bar, uh -huh. like last call, like no joke. Okay. Uh, and uh, she's like the defiant moment. I think maybe we've she all won't been leave. there. Yeah, it yeah. happens all the no. time. Whenever we yeah, shoot that. anything outside, yeah. people are like, no. No. This is a public street yes, and I'm exactly. standing right but here. Times that by a thousand. Yeah, okay, oh good. Uh -huh. And so they wouldn't, the, the guys, security were like, hey, you know, we'll get you a cab. What do we need to do to facilitate this? Yeah. And she's like, you know what? I, and then threw up all over the, the blockade, <laughs> all over his sh knees down. And I'm like, we should be capturing this. Yeah, right, yeah. This should be <laughs> this in should the be movie. in the film. Yeah, this is the trailer <laughs> right now. I like the way you think. Yeah. <laughs> they didn't get it, though? No. Well, maybe next time. No, exactly, yeah. <laughs> well, you've really made the movie seem glamorous, I have to yes, say. Yes, it was. <laughs> it was. Well, it's very good to see you. you uh, Taylor Kitsch, everybody. The music is called 21 Bridges. It opens tomorrow. You're back with Jesse Reyes. If you like that video, click the subscribe button, but only if you're ready for commitment.